What's up guys, DJ Gabuli Architect here and welcome to my channel. Our topic for today is how to use this modify tool. Okay, this one is the move, the copy, stretch, rotate, mirror, scale, trim, fillet, array, eraser, explode, and offset. Okay, let's start for the move. Okay, I make a rectangle. Then, how to use move? Just select this one, click, select, enter, then move. Or just type M, shortcut for move, enter, select, enter click and move okay next is copy just select this one copy then select the rectangle enter click then here 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 okay that one is a copy or shortcut for co then Circuit for CO is copy, enter, select, enter, click, then select. Yun. Yan ang purpose ng copy. Or again, copy, enter, select, enter, click, then here. You can specify the first point. Let's say... 10. Yan. So, di ba, dito, from center to center, that is 10 meters. Okay. I-delete natin to. Okay. Okay, next is stretch. Just select the stretch, click, then select this one, the rectangle, then enter yon stretchable na siya pag select mo yan oh yan okay or just type s shortcut for stretch enter select enter then like that again just enter only select enter yan that's the use of stretch okay next is rotate just select this one select then select the rectangle enter then rotate like that mm. or you just type R for reference enter then specify the reference angle let's say 45 enter yun ito na yung uh, angle ng rectangle again RO shortcut for rotate then select like that oh, yan pwede niyan marotate okay next is mirror okay gawa tayo ulit ng rectangle just REC shortcut for rectangle enter that then how to use mirror just select this one click then select the rectangle enter then here then erase source objects say no like that Yun. again mi shortcut for mirror enter select enter then if sabihin natin yes yun nawala dito yung rectangle bumaliktad lang so again mi enter select no yun yun ang yes ng mirror okay how about skill skill just click this one skill click skill then, select natin to select, 
then enter specify the base point dito then our reference side let's say put it times 2 yun ito na yung scale pinalaki na natin na lang times 2 so again easy shortcut for scale enter select this rectangle enter reference here then let's say 0.5 ibalik natin sa dati yun yun ang use ng scale okay next trim paano ba paggawa ng trim gawagawa tayo ng line then vertical line so select this trim then click this vertical line then enter select so na delete yung yung ano dito yung pag click natin yung pag trim natin ng lines again tr shortcut for trim enter select this one enter and delete this one okay again make another line horizontal line yan yan so again click this one trim or tr shortcut for trim enter select this one enter then i-delete natin to ito at saka ito yun yun ang purpose ng trim okay next is fillet ano bang use ng fillet okay just click this one click select this one select this one yun nawala yung linya dito again fillet type f shortcut for fillet enter select this one select this one yun yun ang use ng fillet Pwede lang yung ano, another, another uh, uh, ibang paggawa ng use ng fillet. Just type F, enter, then reduce. Let's say type R or select this one. Then reduce of 1. Then enter. Select this one. Select this one. Again, enter. Select this one. Select this one. Yun. Yun ang purpose ng Three uh, fillet. Go what another line. Okay. Fillet again. Just type F. Enter. Select this one. Select this one. Again. Enter. Select this one. Select this one. Yan. Ito yung use ng fillet. So next is Ari. Paano ba gagawin tong Ari? Okay. Kopyahan natin to. Sa so, paggawa ng Ari. I-click mo lang to, Click. And select the object. Select. Dito. Pag-select mo yan, gagawa ka lang 10 pieces ng rectangle. So, type 10. Enter. 10 again. Enter. Yun. Delete natin to. Yun. 4, 8, 12. Oh, 12 pala na uh, ano, rectangle. Ito yung paggawa ng array. Again, just type rectangle. Then, select this one. Select. Then, array select. Select the object. Then, enter. Then, let's get the spacing is how, how many rows? Let's type this one. Rows. Let's say 5, enter, 5, enter, yun. Uh, yun, basta ganun ang paggawa ng array. So, next is eraser. Eraser, erase mo lang yun. Click this one, then enter, yun. Erase natin. Or shortcut for E, erase, for erase, enter. Select this object. Yan. Delete na. Yan ang use ng eraser. How about explode? 
ang explode let's say for example gagawa tayo ng rectangle yan, naka pulley line yung rectangle so pag gamitin natin explode just select this one then click the object enter, yun, explode na yung rectangle again, again, again gagawa tayo ng rectangle then, explode just type x ay no x a shortcut for explode enter select this one object enter then yun na explode mo na yung rectangle so next is offset okay ang offset gagawa tayo ng line along use ng offset so just type uh, just click this one click then offset specify offset distance let's see 5 then enter select this one yun so ito ito na yung 5 so i-dimension natin yun naka offset sya ng 5 or again gawa tayo ulit line offset just type O shortcut for offset enter then let's make it let's make it thin distance ating offset then enter select yun so ito ito na yung 10 meters na offset so parang yan lang so may natutunan naman kayo guys so don't forget to like share and subscribe